Animal Care Services reaching out to the community today as they investigate a case of animal cruelty. A dog, now named Lady, was found at a home just southwest of downtown in dire condition. A marking on her ear, now the focus of the investigation. Eric Hernandez shares what we know about this case and Lady's recovery, but we do want to warn you that some of the images in this story are disturbing. Malnourished, overgrown nails, and broken teeth. Just some of the injuries Lady is dealing with. When they you know, came across uh, Lady, she was in the backyard of a suspect's home, spoke to the uh, potential uh, suspect, um, and obviously, you know, it's pretty self-explanatory what they found. Even though Lady was picked up here at a home on Espinosa Street, investigators are still trying to figure out her background and where she came from. That's our primary objective is trying to establish, you know, what, what's, what's the history of Lady? You know, where, where did she come from and how did she end up in this? condition. A key to her history is a number that is tattooed on her ear. As usual indications that she's some type of working dog and we've searched in the known databases trying to find any uh, information on her and unfortunately we're kind of at a dead end. That is why investigators are asking for the public's help. If they have any information on Lady or if, if they have any um, idea of where she came from, what's her background, um, you know, please come forward and, and contact with the investigators. In the meantime, Lady continues to improve proven health and is expected to make a full recovery. Eric Hernandez, KSAT 12 News. So far, nobody has been charged in this case. ACS says they still need to figure out Lady's history. And just a couple hours ago, it appears our KSAT viewers helped us find out where Lady is from, which appears to be, as records show, from Belgium. Lisa Norwood with ACS sent us a statement about the findings. She said, quote, we are amazed at how quickly your viewers were able to solve this pretty girl's mystery tattoo. We know her name is Elta and she's 12 years old, but how does a dog get from a small town in Belgium to a backyard in South Texas? That's what we hope to find out. And we've reached out to her original owner to see if he can shed light on how Elta came to be in San Antonio.